spot so close to me. Helping you get where you need to be. Travel news from BBC Radio Shropshire. Traffic generally is not looking too bad at all so far this morning. Just be aware in Ironbridge, the wharfage remains shut because of flooding between Dale End and Churchill roundabouts. Jiggers Bank, which would ordinarily be part of the diversion, remains shut as well. So you will have to find an alternative. Uh, that remains shut because of a landslide caused by flooding about a month ago. Not too bad as you head along the A49 through Church Stretton and towards Ludlow. You may find a bit of congestion on parts of the A5 between Oswald Street and Shrewsbury. Generally it's on the move. Expect some congestion in the town centres though, however there's a lot of uh, sales shopping traffic about. Liz Saul, BBC Radio Shropshire Travel. You bought out in the sales? Uh, I have actually, oh, I've got wonderful. dragged out to the sales. Oh really? Yeah, My yeah. mum's staying at the moment so actually you have to be on your best behaviour. Why? She's, she's Why? listening to you. Oh no. She's heard all about you. She's an Arsenal supporter. Of course she is, that's oh. why I'm fifth generation, it oh, kind of follows crikey. you see. My mum's an Arsenal supporter, her mum's an Arsenal supporter, her parents are oh, Arsenal supporters. But anyway me. you have to be on your best behaviour. Well I'm, I'm trying to be on my best behaviour, you yes. know things so far have been going swimmingly well oh, I well, Yes, and, uh, but the thing is, is, you know, she's in a really great mood because I got her a ticket for the Arsenal next year, you know, the um, January match as part of a present. Oh, right. So she's in a really great mood. So she's but got, she's got to go to the Emirates that. Stadium then, has she? Oh, yeah, she's been before. Will she be uh, sitting down or standing up? Sitting down. All Until the time? Until we score, and then she'll stand up. Well, that's wrong. And she'll go, yay! What? That is wrong. Why? There's been a lot of arguments about it. No, excuse me. I've got to discuss this with you. There's been a lot of arguments about this. There are certain clubs who say we want to have standing again. Mm, oh, yes, about the terraces yep, argument. Yeah, right, OK. About this. Mm. And there are lots of people who say, look, I go to a football match, I want to sit down, I want to watch the game. Whether they're infirm or whether they're super-duper fit like me, mm. they just want to sit down and watch a game of football. Yes, get excited, go, yes, goal, or, well, well played. Yeah. My, my mum would whatever. agree with you there, yes. because she likes to be able to sit down, and yes. then, you know, you sort of, uh, well, you leap up with the excitement, but generally you're sitting down. Yeah, but no, that uh, that's not what, it doesn't happen like that, does it? Well, do you know? Because people are... stand up and you can't then see what's going on. Well, you have to stand up no. as well. No! But there are different sections, I don't know about your lot, but uh, the Arsenal, there's a family enclosure. Yes. So you sit down there, it's encouraged, because obviously you're teaching your children good manners and all the rest of it. So well, what about the heathens on the other stands? Oh, then? what, the away fans? Well, no. <laughs> I've got the answer to this anyway. I was thinking oh, yes. about this. When I heard this news, you know, they were talking about it on the radio mm. very early this morning, I sat there and I got the answer. Go on. So I'm prepared to offer my answer to the uh, Premier League, to the Football League. Uh, for millions of pounds. No, no, at very little cost. Right. Whatever uh, you do, first of all, you need to patent it or they'll just thief your idea for nothing. Well, I'm prepared to do that because somebody one, one day will say that was Colin Young's idea. I heard that on the radio. They what, might name what, a terrace after you. Probably. What you do mm -hmm. is at your arsenal... Or yes. your Manchester. Or your Everton. Or your Everton. Mm -hmm. Or anywhere else yes. where all these numpties keep standing up at your greenhouse meadow. People who choose to stand up. No, you're not allowed to stand up. You've got a seat. What? Yes, you can. What you do is you take out every other row of seats. Yes. Right? Yeah. So when the person who is now in front of you stands up, you can still see from your seated position <laughs> over their head. There's take a out problem with that. Uh, there is no problem. There is. You take the out ticket prices will go up because there'll be less seating. You take out every other row of seats. And do you know how much a ticket costs these days anyway? It doesn't matter. If I buy a ticket, I want to sit down. Why don't you just sit at the front? No, because you don't get a very good view, do you? Well, I do. Stroll on. Wait, hold on. Stroll on. When you go to the football, do you stand up? I do. No, when they he doesn't. Score. Right. No, you're not allowed to. Sorry. <sighs> Thank you. I'll see you later. Or, or not, oh, as the case though. may be. Uh, yeah, all right, say hello to your mum for me. Hello, I el will. hello, Janet. Lizzie's mum. Janet, how are you doing? Right, here you go. This is, this is what you should do. Bit of Michael Jackson. Get that dancing boots on. You could play a Michael Bublé. Oh, get out of here.